Okay guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to make some Ashore legume. Um, where we're going to start with this is we've got green runner beans, we've got carrots. Now we've got 200 grams of each of those and obviously it's been done like that. So we're going to put that in. We've got our 200 gram of white cabbage sliced thinly like that. So we're going to put that in a bowl. We're going to want to soak the water a little bit. I'm going to blanch this for two minutes. If you do like your vegetable crunchy, I'd recommend you blanch it for about a minute and a half and you stir fry it after for like literally one to two minutes. So now we're just doing this blanching for two minutes. I've got the timer on, so we're just going to let that go. Guys, once that's done and you've blanched it, taste a bit of your veg. See if it's crunchy enough. If it's not, leave it to cool down normally. If it's at the right right place where you like the crunch, run it through cold water as a heat will make it carry on cooking. So we're now going to leave this to completely dry. Five garlic cloves in here, about an inch's worth of ginger, one and a half tablespoon of mustard seeds. The rest of the mustard seeds I've left in here, so we will be throwing it in while we're frying. We're going to get this blended. Guys, now that's, that's blended, um, we're going to obviously mix it with this in a plastic bowl so it doesn't stain. Um, guys, that's the paste we've got for the asha. We're now going to do the asha. In here we've got four tablespoons of oil and two tablespoons of mustard oil. Throw in the three shallots that we've got. Guys, now that that's been cooking for about two minutes, we're going to put the paste, astral paste that we made in here. This is what's going to give you the vibrant colour. Guys, now that that's done, here comes the magic. I'm going to do this for about two minutes for me. But that's the consistency that I like for the crunch. And guys, this is where I'm going to add the chilies in for the heat. And then I'm going to add the salt in. Remember guys, salt to taste. And then lastly, the two tablespoons of the vinegar. Thank you. 